Communication is always vital when competing in tournaments. Winning a match requires perfect coordination. You cannot win by yourself. Raid Call. Communication for winners. In League of Legends, 12 items are being changed in the 3.04 patch. On today's episode of Wall Math, we'll be taking a look at how those items were affected. Let's take a look at the items now. The Aegis of the Legion now grants nearby minions an additional 5 armor, 7.5 magic resistance, and 5 health regeneration. This means a minion will be granted an additional 430 gold worth of stats. The Runic Bulwark now costs 250 less gold, but will grant 100 less health and 5 less magic resistance from the aura. One is now overspending by 98 gold when purchasing a Runic Bulwark, as opposed to saving 16 gold per Previously, the aura will now be worth 100 less gold. The runic bulwark will also grant an additional 5 armor, 12.5 magic resistance, and 5 health regeneration to nearby minions. The locket of the iron solari now costs 150 less gold and will grant 100 less health. One is now saving 324 gold on this item as opposed to saving 438 gold previously, not taking the active effect into account. The Renan's hurricane's bolts now have 75 more range. A sheen now costs 60 less gold. One is now overspending by 256.25 gold on a sheen as opposed to overspending by 316.25 gold previously, not taking the Spellblade effect into account. The Trinity Force now costs 60 less gold. One is now saving 569.4 gold on this item, as opposed to saving 509.4 gold previously, not taking either of the Trinity Force's unique effects or bonus movement speed into account. The Iceborne Gauntlet now grants 10 more armor, but 10 less ability power. One is now saving 124.5 gold on an Iceborne Gauntlet, as opposed to 142 gold previously, not taking the Spellblade effect into account. The Ravenous Hydra now costs 200 less gold and grants 2% more lifesteal. One is now saving 720 gold by purchasing this item, as opposed to 440 gold previously, not taking either of the item's unique effects into account. The Zephyr now grants 5 more attack damage. One is now saving 138.5 gold by purchasing this item, as opposed to overspending by 61.5 gold previously, not taking the tenacity or bonus movement speed into account. The Warden's Mail and Randuin's Omen now reduce 5% less of an enemy's attack speed. If we assume enemy attack speed lost is of equal value to attack speed gained, both of these items have had their value reduced by 166.65 gold. The Seeker's Arm Guard now grants 5 less initial ability power. It will now take 6 stacks for this item to become cost effective, as opposed to 1 stack previously. Overall, 5 items were nerfed, 5 were buffed, and 2 were somewhat in between. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you'd like to be informed whenever I release new videos. Click the annotation on the screen if you'd like to see the previous previous LawMath episode. You can also like LawMath on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and join the community on Reddit. Thanks for watching this episode of LawMath.